Episode two. Episode two, baby. Episode one was pretty decent. Episode two, we're gonna get into a little bit more crazy adventures yep, that and we got into. Y'all share if you can. Share yeah, like, comment, friends. subscribe, yep. all that. Cause uh, we got a lot of views. Mother don't want us to subscribe. What's up? How we feeling? Come on now. You know <laughs> some of these is. stories involve y'all, so shoot. Come on. A man. lot of them don't involve. Ninety percent don't involve the people who's watching. Exactly. And we love y'all too. You know. Um, shout out to Sierra. You know, she first one comment made two comments. Oh, Charlie, comment. Charlie, whoever, everybody who comments, shout out to y'all, man. We love y'all. We appreciate the comments. Mm. Say, man. Hey, man. You remember that time when you was at the park and you got your butt whooped? <laughs> yeah, you want to tell them about that? I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> hey, he know. <laughs> he know. <laughs> nah. <laughs> uh, we gonna get into that. So. Shout out to my mama. When I say my mama wasn't no joke, she wasn't no joke. She let her get away with a lot of stuff. <laughs> Some stuff. Yeah, she wasn't no joke. She just like daddy. She didn't let us get away with that. If she didn't want to whoop did. us, she sick daddy on us. That's what she did. True, true, true. <laughs> that do make sense. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, we're going to talk about it. We're going to cut straight through it, man. Cut through a can, the oil, and the paper. All right. So, anyway, I was uh, 17 or 18. I know I was still in high school. So man, it was a bright and sunny day. It was on the weekend, bro. Feeling good. You know, we was trying to wash the car up. And uh, I was about to roll to the park, man. So what I was going to do... My mama didn't know I was going to the park, and here's the reason why she didn't know I was going to the park, because the park wasn't a place for kids. And if you don't wow. understand what we're talking about, <laughs> you, man, my brother let yeah. you know. Back during that time, it was a lot of shooting, it was drug dealing, the whole nine happened at the park during yeah. that time. So, And our parents told us, you might not be caught dead oh, at man. that park. Yeah. So that means you get shot on your last breath. You better, you better roll get away from that <laughs> You better get away from that part. <laughs> Jesus, somebody get my arms. Hey, like, mm -hmm. that, that's how treacherous our parents thought it was. I mean, it, it, it got wicked, though. But it wasn't as bad. We, I guess if you go there a lot, it don't seem that bad. But anyway, so in my mind, I'm like, yeah, I'm going to lie to my mom. Because I washed the car, but we didn't have a vacuum at the time. The vacuum was messed up. So I'm like, I'm finna lie until I'm gonna go to the car wash, the one that was by that um, gas station, and wash and vacuum out the car. So she was like, You ain't going to the park, are you? I'm like, Nah, I'm, I'm, I just, I'm telling you, I'm gonna vacuum out the car and I'm heading back home. My license was already suspended. So that's why she was so, such, like, she was on me. So I was like, nah, I'm going straight home. And I vacuumed out the car from the gas station. She's like, Mac, don't play with me. I said, mama, I'm not, I'm serious. So she was like, all right. So I get the car keys. So in my mind, I'm going to the park, I'm about to. No, I take that back. I didn't think about the park at first. I got, I got up there. We cleaned out the car because I had one of my homeboys go with me. I ain't going to speak on him because <laughs> he made me mad at this story time. But I'm cool now. But anyway, so one of my homeboys went with me. And uh, we was chilling. And we was listening to the music. And this is the crazy part, if I'm not mistaken. He was the one like, hey, man, let's go on the bus. It's just like one block, man. Let's make one block. Let's see who out. I'm like... Bet, let's go. Let's go. One block ain't gonna hurt nothing. So at that time, I got your guy. Guy White, shorty, cheap, cheap, right? So yeah, I yeah, man. Mr. Delro, man. Ripping them ass. Yeah. So I'm over there. Boom, boom, boom. You know, so we ride and we had a uh, Oldsmobile entry. My mama had a maroon. That boy had some, some takeoff. So anyway, I had it clean, man. That mug was nice. So we ride, 
And I'm bumping. We bent the first uh, corner. And he's like, boy, everybody out, man. It's lit today. It's crunk. See, we didn't say lit back then. We was like, man, it's crunk, boy. It's crunk today. We out here. I'm like, yes, sir. So we uh we bend the block. I was like, man, let's come on, man. Let's bend a couple more couple, uh, blocks and then we'll leave. So by the time we been in that block, we bubbling, we seeing everybody, what's up, what's up, what's up? You know, we get to that third corner. And I remember being in it, and I don't know, it's just something didn't feel right. <laughs> something didn't feel right about it. But me being me, young, just dumb, I'm like, I'm being it, you know. So, man, we got, because I think that was the last block, and I was like, we finna go home. Bruh. And when, back in them days, they had a music, what was it called? A loud music law. Loud music law. Well, if your music was so loud, you can get a ticket. Yeah. Hell, you can go to jail. That's how petty win was. Arkansas uh, police officer. Shout out to y'all. You know, keep doing whatever you're doing. No shouts for me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I love you. I, I, love, love I went to jail there a few times. You yes, you did. So. But anyway, so we get it, we get there, and the cop man, I had the music turned up so loud, I couldn't hear the, the sirens. He had woo, woo. we didn't hear that. We heard to when he started hitting that horn, and I looked up, I'm like, oh shit! I said, man, God. So my mind already ticked, man. I'm gonna get up out of this. My life is suspended. So I pulls up, and I I was like. I don't even know the street, man. Dang, I'm terrible with the street. I don't know if it was A Street or nah. I don't know. But it was where the um, old lady used to sell candy out that street, that house, by that house. Where they got me. I think. Or it was closer to the park. Anyway, so I get pulled over. Cop get out the car. In my mind, I'm like, man, I'm finna play this. I'm finna see how far he gonna, you know, he gonna let me take this because I'm finna lie. I'm finna lie, 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 lie. My mama already told me she better not catch me at the park. I'm finna lie. So anyway, bruh, I tell him I'm 14. I told him uh, I ain't got no license. And I told him I stayed where that, I'm, I believe it was the old lady that sold the candy. I told him I stayed over there. I'm like, I was just cleaning the car and I'm heading home now. So I'm telling it so good the cop is believing me. And he's like, oh yeah? Well, okay, you know, we'll let you go on and get to it. And before he said it, my homeboy, I don't know what possessed him. I don't know if he was just scary or he was just <laughs> dry snitching. <laughs> Whatever, I'm <laughs> hating it. Or he was like, this story going so good. Let me start throwing some truth in there, see if he can handle that. Like, like he was trying to test me to see if I can handle it. I'm like, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, what a bear. His life is suspended. Get out of that. <laughs> you know? So when he did that, it was like the cop looked at me. I looked at the cop. I said, he said, your life is suspended. I said, yeah. He's like, so you ain't 14. I said, nah. He said, step out the car. When you hear that, <laughs> step out the car. I said, God. <laughs> I should have said, man, hey, man, if you don't send me to jail, give me a reason to go to jail. Let me put my foot in there and stomp him out. <laughs> so anyway, he put me out the car. I forgot how some of the conversation went, but he was like, What's your mama number? That's what I know it was bad. I, this is how I know it was bad. Because when he said, well, I need to know what's your parents' number. I'm going to call him. Up. I'm like, you, you can just take me to jail, bro. <laughs> I ain't even got to do that. You just take me to jail. I'm like, you ain't got to do all that, player. Just take me to jail. He's like, no, we need your parents' number. He got my mama number. And I don't know if he had on speakerphone or if I was talking to him. I think I was talking to her because she was like, what's going on? Who is this? I said, mom, it's me. She said, what happened? You good, y'all? Yeah? I said, the police got me up here. Where at? The park. What? When she heard the park. What? 
what? And this is what this is when I knew I was in trouble. Rob was uh, over there with my mom at the time. Rob Johnson, my cousin. Shout out to the lady today. Cold blooded. I'm cold blooded for that one. But I still look. He gonna be like, uh, it was she the way it was supposed to be. Yeah. So she said, Rob, I need a ride up here. They got Mac pulled over at the park. And Rob, okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is how cold Rob is though. So we we sitting there, we waiting, I'm in the car. I'm like, God oh, man. She's probably gonna hit me a couple times and we're gonna be straight, you know. This is what I'm thinking, like she's gonna hit me or probably yell at me, slap me. I can take that, you know, on some, you know, look like a gangster when you get hit by your mama, you know. Pow, I'm good. Yeah, like pow, I'm good. mama dang. And the I'm girl's good. like, oh, yeah, the couple here. I love that. Ooh, look at that. He's he's a bad in the car. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> nigga didn't know. <laughs> she got out the car when Rob and then pulled up. She got out the car. And I heard her because I had the windows down. Rob, you got your belt? I said, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I said, belt? <laughs> no, leave out the park. Man. The park was still packed. Oh, yeah, the park was still I got to yeah. get it up. The park was still packed. So it was kids. Because the police, you know, when the police pull you over, people know they. Who is that? Oh man, let's go over here see. So it was already a crowd forming <laughs> when it, when I was sitting in the car, Bruh, When I heard my mama say, "Give me the belt," and I saw her coming with the belt to the cop, I ain't gonna lie, rolled the windows up, bah, I locked it door. I said, <laughs> "Mama, mama can contest." She said. Boy, open this door right now. Mm -hmm. I was looking like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mama, let me, let me, let me explain. I don't want to hear nothing. You better open this door. Something said, boy, you better not open that door. <laughs> but the way my mama looks, you better open that door. She's going to break that window. <laughs> so, I instantly, back out. As soon as I did that, she, get out the car. I'm like, oh, shoot, mama, what? What? Man, bro, she went to town. I don't know if you ever had a guy whoop from your ankles all the way up to, to, to your back. This is how the cheapest <laughs> So then what's funny is the kids, when she popped it off, it was a bunch of little kids all the time. Look, he getting a whooping. I want to shit to wear this up. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh, <laughs> my friends. You know what I'm saying, y'all? But it's like, look, y'all, he get the whooping. So everybody, the whole crowd laughing. And the cop was standing there. My mama was getting me so good, she hit him. And he was like, hey. She's like, you might want to step back. <laughs> this dude stepped back. I'm like, she just assaulted you. She been assaulting me for a good 30 seconds. Where's the law? <laughs> when cops didn't care, they didn't I'm care. Like, where's the they law? They let you get whooping. They didn't Man, care about that. they did not care. He stepped back like, all right, you get it. She committed to be no brakes off of me. In my mind, though, I was like, don't you cry. <laughs> don't you cry. It's too many people out here. Holy don't you yeah. cry. So, and people know me. <laughs> when I'm about to cry, I do this. I get the blinking up and looking. <laughs> Trying to catch my tear, I get to. <laughs> so, but, <laughs> my mama threw me in the car. She jumped in the car. She fussing the whole time. And then she told my partner in the back, and I ought to whoop you too for letting you go. My boy, like, why don't you? <laughs> I said, yeah, you should. Mommy sure was. <laughs> like, I was listening. Because I'm like, he the one who got me in trouble. Somebody need to get whooped. He can get by me or my mama. Somebody need to whoop me. But yeah, that, that was the story when I got whooped at the park. Um, this is when I was uh, graduating in 2004. He caught me old in the comments. I swear I'll beat you up. I'm going to find you. I'm going to find you. Anyway, so this Let's was uh, a graduation. Dang. Yep. I'm sorry. I'm this sorry. is graduation. <laughs> and um, we went and um, it was me and some more people because I've been name dropping a lot today. And, and, and 
and I need to chill. But uh, us family, people we love, you know, yeah. y'all, y'all know we love you. So, but uh, we went and we um, went to a um, whole uh, what was what's the name of that uh, hotel? Uh, Coachman. Coachman. So man, I'm talking about from the time I graduated, because I was the one. I don't know if y'all remember, wasn't nobody <laughs> going to graduation with Air Force One on with the tongue out. I was the first one who did that and win. And uh, so in my mind, you know, I'm, I'm thinking I'm a trendsetter. I'm turn, we finna turn up. So we go to Coachman and uh, we get there, man. It was a group of people, man. They, they was like, everybody was gonna be in Coachman. We finna just, you know, do our thing. So, bro, I'm going to tell you how crazy it was. If you seen Cheech and Chong when they were smoked out in that car, that's how it was when you opened the door of the uh, hotel, man. It was yeah. like we came in there, boom, opened the door. I mean, it was at least 10, 15 of just in the circle, just bow, bow, just smoking, passing. Shout out to my boy JB. This dude passed the blunt like... Bruh, it was big. It looked like my goddamn arm. He was blunt. So, we smoking, and we chilling, we vibing. And at this time, I was a true pothead. I, I mean, I was a true pothead. He was. And my homeboy, he wasn't. But uh, we was smoking. And we, we all were vibing, though, until it was time to leave. <laughs> Bruh, it was time to leave. So, my boy... And <laughs> we all in the car. And at this time, we had the video camera. And I was luckily, man, I ain't even got the video no more. I don't know what happened to that tape. But we was videotaping. But at that time, we didn't videotape what we was doing. But <laughs> just to uh, get to it. So we in the car. We riding. We on our way home. I mean, we all blitzed. Like, we all. We, we gassed out. I mean, we gassed out. Next thing you know. You hear, turn the music down, turn the music down. And be like, what's up, man? What's up? <laughs> My boy said, at first he said, I gotta pee, I gotta pee, I gotta pee, I gotta stop the car, I gotta pee, I gotta pee. Bro, my stomach hurt, I feel like I'm gonna throw up, I gotta pee. So we like, bro, chill out, man. We we about to get home, bro. We 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 if you don't remember uh if you know when we was on Front Street one. <laughs> yeah. So you know what time it is, how the police got in on Front Street. So we on Front Street. He like, bruh, no, I gotta pee. Then he's like, let me out. So we we stopped, we went to let him out, and then he's like, No, nah, I got boo boo. <laughs> I got boo boo. No, I got boo boo. <laughs> we like, what? He said, I'm about to boo boo on my <laughs> y'all let me. Let me out, let me out about the boo on the That time I was like, nah, stop. <laughs> let him out. Because I'm right beside him. I ain't trying to smell all that. So we let him out, bro. I'm about to switch the camera because y'all going to see how he was. So he was like, man, I got a boo boo. Let me out, let me out the car, let me out the car. So we stopped. And I'm cracking jokes already because I'm high. I'm, I mean, I'm high, boy. <laughs> So I'm cracking your little stupid body ass boy. I'm like, get your, uh, I got a boo-boo in the middle of the street. You know, we just going in. I'm like, thumbtack booty ass boy. We like, we going in. So he was like, man, forget all that, let me. So he got out, I'm gonna switch. He gets out the car. Can you see? Yeah, yeah. He's like, oh, oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> we made it home and we all fell asleep. But this how cold is because I ain't gonna say his name because he but he cracked jokes. I Say mean, mine. Just know 
that he was cracking jokes like crazy. The next that day. boy, that boy <laughs> would roast a flea. <laughs> <laughs> so as soon as I woke up, he <laughs> hit me with, oh, you thought I forgot what you were saying? <laughs> when I was out. When I was uh, high, he started getting up. He was like, roasting. Yeah. <laughs> he was getting He was cooking you. I was like, dang. <laughs> Let me hold on, man. Dang. <laughs> yeah, he told me up. But um, <laughs> shout out to him, man. Love him to death, man. That's Ken Folk, too, man. <laughs> All right, y'all. That, that was Growing Up with Johnson podcast. podcast. Be on the lookout for our lifestyles and our merchandise. I merchandise. <laughs> yes. I don't know. 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 I don't